Hi, um, Esme is almost 11 months at the moment, which is super, isn't it? Yes, it is. Oh, attack at the keyboard. As you can see, she is huge. <laughs> She's still a bouncing baby. And um, we actually, I think, I think I've probably showed you a video of it on the internet, but she's got her own bouncer now, so I don't have to spend all day going, woo, sort of thing. Um, ah, yeah. She's oh. getting lots of hair too, as you can see. Lots of hair growing. One day you'll need it cut like mummy. Yes, you will. You want it cut? No, we'll just grow it long until she's like, covered in hair. That would be lovely, wouldn't it? Yeah, but she is very bouncy. So, um, what have we been doing this month then? Um, not a lot really, because um, I've had quite bad anxiety this month. So we haven't, we've been to baby group I think twice this month. Um, this week obviously it's half term, so there's nothing on. Apart from the, yeah, apart from the you know the government baby group type places which are on. But the thing is, when all the toddler groups are shut, everyone goes there, so it's going to be a bit crowded for us, really. Is that nice? Is that nice? Oh, what's that? Um, we're still breastfeeding, but actually still mostly breastfeeding at the moment because um, she hasn't showed a huge interest in food um, I'm trying to sort of let her graze throughout the day at the moment because just to like get her more used to food really because she mainly wants boobs most of the time and she started she started to understand words as well like, like boobies and boobies boobies and then um, sometimes when she's over, over the side of the room I'm like, it's my boobies and she comes running. It's really funny. Um, and uh, I think she had started to understand yes and no and uh, mum and dad. She could say mum. Oi, clicking. She can say mum and dad. Now mum, which is mainly good mum, mum, mum and dad, 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 dad. Can you, you're so clever. Mm. You should never. Oh dear. Um, we did take her to a soft play place in town the other week, which was really good actually. It was a pound fifty for her because she was under one, which was good. And um, she went on her first ball call. Mm, listen, to her. Um, she went on her first ball call, which was so cute. She was all like. <gasps> Um, I think we have a video of it somewhere, so I might put it on when I remember. I think it's on Alex's phone, so it might take a while. Ooh! Sorry, clicking off of it. You! She are! Yes, you are. Um, she still sleeps in our bed at the moment, just because it's, it's the most um, comfortable place for her to be. Um, when Alex is back on nights, we, we might start like letting her sleep in our her um, travel cot in our room and um, so eventually she'll have to go in her room and obviously because we want to have more babies eventually we can't have more <coughs> in our bed our bed's quite small actually it's like a small double I think yes it is we can't fit all the babies in can we no we can't she's been really clever lately actually she's um She's been dancing to music and um, shaking like rattles in time with music. And yeah, she's, she's been talking her own language quite a lot as well. But still like incoherent babbling mainly, but um, more more kind of words strewn in there. And um, well, it sounds a lot of it sounds like words, but it isn't. If you know what I mean, it's just like sort of thing. Yes, yes. So I think she will talk eventually, but um, she's doing quite well. 
so it's not too much of a worry. Um, she can't walk on her own yet, but she can sort of walk with support around the table. Or ow! Ow! Oh! She can bite me. <laughs> um, sometimes she uses her walker and sort of pushes it around. Oi! Don't bite, mummy! Sometimes she uses her walker and pushes it around. <laughs> You're crowding at everyone. Which is really clever, isn't it? This is. No. Can you show everyone your cute, cute bit? <gasps> oh, that's so cute! <laughs> As you can see, she's got four teeth. I think she's got some more coming up. Um, we have to clean them now. Um, we use, like, probably twice a week we use the milk tea, like fluoridated stuff, but um, all the rest of the time we use this organic mandarin stuff. Um, I can't remember what company, I think it's the green people, but uh, it's much better for them really. Um, much better isn't it? We don't obviously don't want her to get like problems from fluoride and stuff so we don't use it very often. Oh yes! And she drinks a lot of milk still so she, you go off. So she's getting lots of calcium anyway. Lots of calcium! Right she's got off, off, got off, um, excuse me. Um, so yeah she's doing very well and I, oh hello! I've lost a lot of weight recently actually, I'm now like, hello, I'm 7 stone 10, which was quite a surprise, but um, I wondered why my child's kept falling down when I tried to walk about, which is not good really, because I keep having to buy trials and keep thinking, oh good, I put on some weight, so I'm going to be this size now, and then I'll just give away all my clothes to the chair shop, and suddenly I'm like, back at my other size, and I'm like, Rrr. I know a lot of people want to be like a bit slim, but I'm fine being a little bit bigger, really. Just because um, I feel healthier. I don't feel healthy when I'm at this sort of weight. I feel healthy for about three, maybe three or four pounds more, and it does make all the difference for some reason. But um, what I want to do is get some hemp protein. And, oh, that's hemp protein. Yum yum yum. Might put on a little bit of weight, which would be good. Yay! So, so yeah, um, anxiety hasn't been great this month. I think it's because it's like February and, and rubbish weather. Um, but spring will be here soon, so it's exciting. Whee! Thank you, Pooh. We're gonna come back. Oh dear! <laughs> no. So I'm hoping for our first birthday that we'll go and see love my grandparents and have like a birthday tea or something. That would be nice. <laughs> yeah. yeah. She still pants a lot like a dog. Like. Especially when like you give her food and she's like mmm <laughs> hiding. Are you hiding your face? And she still likes peekaboo which is nice. Very nice isn't it? Um, yeah, for her birthday we got, well we did get her um, a load of in the night garden toys, but we seem to have given it to her already, even though they're supposed to be for her birthday, but she really likes them, so that's alright. She probably won't notice if we wrap them up and give it to her again, so um, I'm going to try and get some other stuff. Um, I know some musical stuff I think, because she is musical. Yeah? She likes singing as well. Sometimes you turn around and she's like, ah, are you? Yes, you are. You're so cute. So, yeah, um, that's pretty much it, I think. Um, so, obviously, I haven't been vlog vlogging because there's not been a lot happening, really. Just sort of usual routine and that sort of stuff so I'll probably go. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye bye!